hi guys welcome back to my channel i hope you guys are all doing well thank you so much for watching so for today we're gonna talk about the purse i purchased six months ago from neiman marcus website or neiman marcus store it is called the lulu flat bag mantle say in size small so i currently have it here with me this is the lulu mantle say in size small we are going to talk more about this, the pros and cons, the pricing, and so on and so on. But before that, please subscribe to my YouTube channel to see more of my videos. So I bought this purse on Neiman Marcus website through Rakuten when they had 10% cashbacks. The retail price for this was $1,900 and 10% cashback was $190. So I basically saved myself $190. And on top of that, Neiman Marcus was doing this gift card promotion where you'll buy something from their website and then you'll get a gift card. Only online purchases. So I was able to get up to $300 gift card. So I basically got $300 gift card plus $190 cash back. So I saved myself $490. And you know me, I love deals. I love coupons. I love saving money on anything, groceries, clothing, shoes, bags, with everything and it just feels good when i know i save money um so that gift card as well i use it to buy another purse from nima marcus but i i use that gift card and it worked well because i saved 300 dollars from that purchase so yeah let's talk about the pros so the pros of this purse is that i like the style because the style or the design you can literally wear it with anything you can be like all fancy and dress up and it will still look good and then like casual and you know it'll still look good and all it will match i still have the original like this thing the inside i always put i always store them with the this papers inside because it keeps their shape so i always have that inside so if you see i like how you can wear them like this like you know a shoulder bag oops i dropped something like that if you guys can see or like um you can like do this and do like what do you call it like you can do a cross bag so that's the cross bag style i'm sorry i'm in my bedroom there's not enough space here so that's the cross bag and then the shoulder bag so like that so you can literally wear it with anything because you can change the style so that's one of the things I like about this purse is that you can like change the, the strap. <laughs> also, so the design is very nice. The straps is adjustable or like you can switch it. And also another thing is that it's very spacious. Like if you look inside, I like how there is a compartment here and then the zipper for like your phone or like important things so it's very spacious you can put your wallet sunglasses a little makeup bag your keys and other things hand sanitizer mask they're all they will all fit um also what else do i like about this i like how it's lightweight it's not really heavy like right now it's not heavy for me because there's nothing inside but even if i put all my necessities it's still very light and it's easy to to use so those are the things that i love about this and then the things that i don't like about i guess you know how this opening sometimes it's really hard like it's you know when i'm i'm wearing them like cross back i'm like struggling to close it especially i noticed that you have to 
put a lot of things in order for it to close easily so when there's nothing inside it's so hard to like close the the flap but when it's full and it's the the shape you know the shape is um, form well then you can easily close it so that's the one thing that I noticed about that that I struggle whenever I wanted to close the purse and also another thing I don't like how the stitching they're already coming off where is that and I barely use this purse so you can see they're already um, coming off I have another stitching here that's already coming off in six months time and I barely use them and also like I guess the skin is already coming off as well so those are the things that I don't like about this purse the stitching are coming off the skins are coming off and I will start this really nice and put the papers inside Oops, and i barely use this so the stitching or the skin coming off is not really my main issue my main issue is the flap being hard to close and open when it is not full inside but other than that you know i love this purse i know i feel like the stitching and the skin coming off is part of the wear and tear but at the same time, it's kind of a bummer for six months time that to have that issue. But at the same time, it's, you know, part of the wear and tear depending how you use your purse and store them. But other than that, I love this purse so much because I can put so much things inside and it's easy to, to carry and you can like change from a uh, handbag to like a cross bag. So I love this so much. I, I did a lot of research before purchasing this purse and I'm glad that I bought this because it's such a good investment. So yeah, hope you guys like this video and if you guys have any other questions or anything, please comment down below and I'll be happy to answer all your questions or concerns. And please subscribe to my YouTube channel to see more of my videos. Thank you so much for watching and have a good day. Bye!